Hey, what's up, you guys? Jordan Jeske here. Today we're going to be talking about power. For us as golfers to be able to transfer power efficiently through our body, we need to be able to dissociate our upper body from our lower body. One of the exercises and drills I get my golfers to do are called the dissociation planks. So you're going to find a bench or couch anywhere at home, and you're going to get into a nice strong plank position, and you're going to open up with your right hand. Think of this as your backswing as a right-handed golfer. Hips stay relatively square to the ground. As you come down through, you're going to drive your knees through. Okay, now I don't want you to just go knee to chest. I actually want you to feel that rotation. You can kind of pivot on that one foot a little bit. So again, start off slow, drive, other side, drive. And then as you can feel comfortable with it, you can add some speed. You can add a push up in as well to get some upper body push strength and power. But again, that little knee drive is to imitate this little downswing, sort of a downswing to fire through, create some power through our golf swing. Those hips, once they get start to move, the rest of our body can come through and create some more club head speed, and hopefully a little bit extra distance off the tee. Give that a go next time you're in the gym or at home.